thought that we would always be together. Huh? Huh? Whoa, Uni! Riku, what are you doing here? I was gonna ask you that! Here, look! Ta-da! Uh, you got one too? You betcha! I thought it was just some stupid junk mail It doesn't even have a return address on it. But I figured I'd come check it out, and I'm glad I did! It's been so long, Uni, how are you? Good. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I told myself we could see each other whenever we wanted, but time just kept passing. The letter said to check the fifth seat from the right in the front row of the east block, right? And that would be here. Pain! Long time no see. You got a letter too, Pain? Looks that way. Has it been three months? Feels like more than that. What are you complaining about? You two are the ones who got off the ship in the first place, remember? <laughs> 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 I missed you! I suppose some bonds just can't be broken. Welcome back! Uh, um, uh, thanks, Riku. Where's brother? He's out shopping with Buddy. Forget about that! Come on, Uni, read the letter! Read it, read it! Oh, right. Travel to Udiser. Reach the top by powers yours and yours alone, and there will be something worth seeing. That's it? That's it. Udiser? What's a Udiser? Udiser Tower. I've heard of it. Only rumors, though. A ruined tower just recently discovered, so they say. I've got an idea where it might be. Then let's go! Take the helm, Payne! Me? I think Brother will get mad if he finds out, won't he? Who cares? Well, that settles that! Wait! Why? R! P. Uh, <laughs> this doesn't look good. Let's Lift go! Off. It's huge! Good thing we can just fly straight to the top! Haha! <laughs> now where's the fun in that? Well, where's the fun in climbing? Remember the letter. Reach the top by powers, yours and yours alone, and there will be something worth seeing. We should do as it says. Oh, I've got a bad feeling about this. <sighs> Out of shape? <laughs> a little. I haven't gotten much exercise lately. What about you, Riku? Piece of cake. You know why? Because I don't sit around all day doing nothing like you do. You've got me there. So what have you been looking for, Riku? Some machine sunk in the sea or something? That's right. Oh, yeah. You've been helping Shinra, haven't you? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Well, you know how Shinra left the ship and is off researching something or other with Rin? Every now and then he asks me to check out this or that. He says he can't do it himself because he's just a kid. So I'm always looking for ruins on the bottom of the sea or off running all over on some mission or another. Oh yeah, and I did some work for Pops too, because he had another one of his crazy business ideas. Something about striking it rich at the Gagazet Hot Springs and using the money to rebuild home. Brother wasn't too hot on the idea, so I stayed out of it, but I introduced Pops to a business partner. If I had to guess, I'd say Pops is probably working on his Welcome to Awakas right about now. That's Pops for ya. And it looks like the LeBlanc Syndicate has got some ideas of their own, too. But those are Ronso lands, right? They weren't even going to consult with Kimari. Can you believe it? So I helped set up a meeting between them, you know? He Kimari said, worry. Kimari worry hunters defile sacred ground. But LeBlanc just told him the Syndicate does whatever it wants. I mean, show some gratitude, will ya? And then there's Clasco. Sure. You know how kids are. He still bugs me to help him out all the time. It never ends. I end up babysitting the kindergartens on whatever stupid little mission they're on. And the more I help, the more he ends up depending on me. Yeesh! Oh yeah, I heard from Tobley a while ago too. And check I this out, like he wants to hire me to get up on stage and sing. He said I've got to sound as good as you, Uni. We so I've been bad. taking voice lessons from Barkeep. My darling, oh, I love oh. you. Wow, you certainly have been busy. Well, that's one way to put it. Wanna help? Uh, <sighs> 
Reject it again. No matter how many times I ask, she always says no. But if I were as busy as you, I'd go out of my mind. You never want to see me anymore, Uni. <laughs> you know that's not true. <laughs> <laughs> Did she really think I didn't want to see her? It looks so old. That's because it probably is. The people who found it think it might even predate Xanarkand. You're talking about the machine faction, right? They weren't able to find out much. Remember what the letter said. If we make it to the top, there will be something worth seeing. What do you think is up there? Maybe whatever gives this place its name. Oh, hey. Speaking of the machine faction, how's Gipple been doing anyway? Fine, I guess. I haven't seen him for a while. Really? You haven't? Yeah. What about Barrelai and Nuge? Weren't you all together? <laughs> Things aren't that simple. Everyone is busy doing their own thing. I heard that some of the groups had split up. You heard right. The Youth League already did, and New Yevon looks to be next. Yevon is so big that Berylai seems to be having a hard time of it, though. Change is slow, and it's only good if it's the right kind of change. The three of them are making the rounds on apology duty. Nuge says it's their punishment for letting Spira break into splinters. Ugh, that sounds like a pain. Well, I'm sure things will settle down sooner or later. Berylai is as good as any with the old folk. Then the four of you will be able to see each other soon. No, I think they may have to wait a while. Oh, why is that? I... there's something I want to do first. What is it? Ah! Let me guess, it's a secret, right? Well, it's... it's nothing. Aren't you dying to know? I can't always be worrying about other people all the time. <laughs> I guess that's true. I really shouldn't worry about other people, but I can't help it. What is it? It's strange, don't you think? We're so far from Besaid, but the sunset looks the same. Hmm. Yeah, the same. Well, I guess you're right. But even though it looks the same, it actually changes every day. It does? Hmm. It's just something I've been thinking about recently. Hmm. So, you've been staying in Besaid? Yeah, she has. She's totally gone back to her life before she joined the Gull Wings. That's not true at all. Back then, I was only thinking of someone I had lost. I wanted a change from all that, so I left the island. I'm a different person now. I don't feel like I need to keep busy anymore. I'm fine with staying in one place and taking it easy. That sounds relaxing. Hmm. When I'm with Vadina, the days go by so quickly. <laughs> oh, his teeth are starting to come in. Oh, is Waka still a big softy? <laughs> <laughs> Lulu still keeps quiet, but she has plenty she'd like to say. Waka hasn't noticed? When has Waka ever noticed anything? <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Uni, it's good you're not lonely. Yeah. And I'm here now. But it's such a waste being cooped up on that island day in and day out, don't you think? You're not getting any younger, Uni. You gotta get out and have some fun while you can. <laughs> what? It's no big deal. Come on, give us something. Mm. Hmm. Hmm? What? Tell us, Yuna. Oh, sorry. Um, I... Hmm. I... Um... <sighs> but if he's back too, why are you just spending all your time on Besaid, Yuni? You could go on an airship cruise around the world or something! <sighs> Maybe someday. I don't want to rush into anything just now. Until you figure out what you want to do, right? No, that's not quite it. 
I don't feel like I need to find something. I can't really explain it. But you know what I mean, don't you? Uh, well, to be perfectly honest with you, not in the least. Oh, I don't get it either. But I guess you better start thinking about things seriously from now on. <laughs> Maybe you're right. I suppose it would be stranger if nothing at all had changed. I did meet someone. Ooh, did you hear that? Uni's got a guy pain. <laughs> well, come on. Tell us about him. Tell us, tell us, please. <laughs> <laughs> Uni! Oh, okay, so now I get it. That's why you never come when I ask you to. You're not jealous, are you? No, I'm not. Okay, maybe just a little. <laughs> and then a guard found me while I was watching the stage. <laughs> he didn't stand a chance. Bam! Boom! Pow! Ha! <laughs> I kind of feel bad for the guy. Ah, uh, he was just a LeBlanc thug. And you're one to talk, Payne. You beat up a bunch of them. It sounds like you two had some fun. Yeah, while you were strutting around in that silly getup. I'm writing a book. A book? There's so much that happened. I want to make a record of it all. You two should help me write it. Does it really have to be written down for it to be remembered? Whatever. Sorry, but a book doesn't seem like something you do, Payne. I have an idea. Instead of writing about the old stuff, why not write about all the new stuff that's been happening? So what new stuff has been happening? I got a lot of things going on. Seems to me you just stick your head in wherever it fits. Riku, let me ask you this. Just what is it you want to be? Be? Well, that's easy. I, uh, I... <laughs> Come on. Uh, I'm thinking, okay? It's not that I can't decide. It's just nothing comes to mind. Look, I know I can't just sit around and do nothing. I can't stay still in one place. I have to keep busy. Not like you, Uni. Like me? Just passing all those days back on Besaid, wasting your time away. <sighs> That's enough, both of you. To each her own. Let's just leave it at that. Well, I would leave it at that if she would just let me be. Huh, easy for you to say, Payne. You don't care about other people, just yourself. Things were never like this before. Ugh, that thing was so heavy and hot. <sighs> That's not as easy as it looks, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Those were fun times. What do you mean, wasting? I'm not flying all over the place like you, but that's what I want right now. I don't get it. What is? To watch the ocean and go for walks and cook meals. But that's so normal, Uni. But I want normal. Why can't you understand that, Riku? I just can't. You're not doing anything with your life. And you're just fooling yourself by keeping busy all the time. What do you mean by that, huh? What's the matter with you? We finally see each other, and this is what happens? She started it. You started it, Uni. Okay, enough. And you care about others too much! Well, I can't stand to see you wasting your life away! That's none of your business! I said that's enough! Ugh, how far do we have to climb anyway? To the top. And what are we supposed to find up there? How should I know? Ask whoever wrote the letter. I'm asking because I don't know who wrote the letter. Who do you think it was? Someone who knows all three of us, I guess. I wonder if it was LeBlanc. It'd be way over the top if it was her. Hmm. My money's on Rin. You're both wrong. I wrote the letter. I don't know how to explain it. It's stupid, I know that. After we split up, I traveled around by myself for a while. I wasn't lonely, not really. I had things I wanted to do. But when I'm alone, I just feel like something's missing. I thought, if the three of us were together, we'd find something to grab onto again. Payne, you could have just told us. 
Maybe. Wait a minute. What about the part that says there's something for us to see up top? That's just something I came up with. Ugh, you gotta be kidding me. Sorry. I thought it'd be fun to go on an adventure again, just like old times. But it's not going very well, is it? Things were never like this before. You make it sound so long ago. It's only been three months. We could always just go back. No, wait. We've come this far. There's no turning back now. Well, that's a scary way to put it. Hey, what do you think's gonna happen to the three of us after this? If we keep going, maybe we'll find out. You did? What? <sighs> I just remembered something I wish I hadn't. I thought we'd gotten away from the Yevon chasing us. I never saw it coming when Nude shot me. The last thing I remember seeing before I blacked out was a sunset like this one. Shuyan had a hold of him then. That's why he did it. Once Nuge was himself again, he tended our wounds and left us with the Albed. After that, they separated us to keep us hidden from Yevon. You heard all this from Nuge? I've tried to put it all behind me, but I still remember it from time to time. The night I parted ways with my friends and the long nights that came after. I remember too. Back when I first saw Xanarkand. I thought Uni was gonna die if we kept going on like we were. But she'd made up her mind, so I didn't want to get in her way. I couldn't figure out what to do. I remember looking out on the sunset with tears in my eyes. Hmm. It was the same for me. I didn't know anything about the final Aeon. Being together with everyone. I just thought... Listen, listen to, to my, my story. story. This, this may be may our be last, last chance. chance. So, do you think the three of us are... Are what? Just forget it. So do you think we're close? We must be. <sighs> What's wrong? It's a secret. Well, how about I try and guess? Go ahead, you'll never get it. Are you sure? We finally get together. But the problem is, Uni and Pain have changed so much that nothing's going right. If we stay together any longer, we're going to fight. And things will just get worse and worse. I just want to go home before we grow apart any more than we have. Sound about right? How'd you know all that? <laughs> because I'm thinking the same thing. Really? Huh. Why am I not surprised? We are all so different, don't you think? We all think so differently. I realized that last night when we were fighting. Maybe it was just luck that kept us together before. We were together because we had to be. Maybe the three of us never really got along in the first place. So you think we're growing further apart? The more time we spend together? Mm-hmm. Exactly. Am I worrying too much? That's not for me to say. Riku, you feel the same way that I do. I'm really relieved to know that. Oh, okay. Well, at least I'm not alone. I'm glad to know that. I was worried what would happen if we got to the top and then saw something we didn't want to see. I just made that up. Doesn't mean anything. Well, that's what made me curious about it. Since when do you worry so much about the future? That's not like you. Hey, you make it sound like I never think about anything at all, Uni. Here's what I think. There's a lot we don't know about each other. Maybe that's why we fight. If that's true, I have a feeling it won't be the last time. So, shall we go? <laughs> Who knows? If we all make it to the top together, maybe we'll be able to see what the future holds for the three of us. I thought that we would always be together. I told myself we could see each other whenever we wanted, but time just kept passing. This doesn't look good. Oh, I've got a bad feeling about this. 
Did she really think I didn't want to see her? I really shouldn't worry about other people, but I can't help it. I suppose it would be stranger if nothing at all had changed. Things were never like this before. I suppose some bonds just can't be broken. Well, here we are. What do you think we're going to see? You're not still worried, are you? Because if you are, we could just turn back now. No way! Well then, why are P? It's showtime! Huh? How do you work it? I think it's broken. Maybe it's just old. Either way, I think it's... Worthless. Oh. <sighs> so you worried for nothing? You're darn right I did! Climbing all the way up this stupid tower, getting chased by stupid monsters. And we fought with each other for no real good reason. Now we finally get to the top and find nothing but some old piece of junk. Hey, letter writer! Weren't we supposed to see something if we came all the way up here? So, you really don't see anything? No. You sure about that? Because I do. Well? I did see it, but we... We're all different. <laughs> Spending time apart, going different places, seeing different sights. Before we knew it, we had all become different people. Is our time together over now? Are we all going to go our separate ways? If so, then so be it. Who knows when we'll see each other again. Maybe we never will. Still, we'll always have our memories. The three of us laughing, the three of us fighting. Someday we'll all look back and remember the time we spent together. And even if we do grow apart, those moments that we all look back on, those moments will never change.